Hi, my name is Dennis Walters, a.k.a. Walt. That's what most people call me. Um, I've been a teacher at Esperanza High School in Anaheim, California for over 37 years. But at Esperanza, we've developed a program called our Engineering and Manufacturing Academy. And we've been designated as one of SME's 26 prime schools in the country. With our Engineering and Manufacturing Academy and all the high-tech machines we have, we have uh, the Omax water jet, of course. That actually was our capstone piece of equipment for our program. And the thing is, we're better prepared than a lot of colleges. And because of that, some of our kids are able to choose a college direction pathway or an industry pathway. So we get that covered completely with our program. We have quite a few kids, realistically, every year, my seniors, I'll put out maybe four or five that will go right into a work field, interrelated field. Right now I have two kids in internships that are current students. Uh, one is at a water jet firm because of what we had in our machine from Omax and his experience there, and the other one is an aerospace firm. One of the things we've implemented in our engineering and manufacturing academy is the application of mathematics uh, in the program and, and we actually brought one of our geometry teachers over and had her bring a couple classes over. We had one of our students explain to her students how the SOLIDWORKS program works uh, with the multiple planes and she made mention I've been trying for two weeks to explain planes to them and he just did it in 10 seconds. And I said, well, you want to see that? Come on over and I'll show you the water jet and how it has a much better application of the X, Y, Z coordinate system than how we actually use it. So I took them over in a matter of seconds. We drew a figure and I had the kids playing with the machine and moving the X and the Y and they understood what quadrants they're in. And in 10, 15 minutes, they were cutting parts. But one of the things where I see, I see our program only getting better, um, the students were getting I, I put it this way, we're getting more of the science and math kids who are going into engineering because they're starting to realize the importance of it and now the parents are. The parents are the big thing and counselors that need to be aware that there's some high-tech jobs out there. And the engineers for the future and the machinists and manufacturers for the future have to have facilities like ours and like all the prime school programs. And, and OMAX is a big supporter of that. When I started looking for a water jet, I contacted several companies and Omax was the only one that really wanted to talk on a new machine to put into an educational facility. Here's what I found ever since then. It's got the best tech support and I tell this story to everybody I know. We had a little problem with something one evening in my night class and my one student says, well, how can we get a hold of tech support? And I was busy with my other class, and I had 30, or the whole class, I had 30 kids. Next thing you know, I turn around, and he's on the phone to tech support, and he walked him through the problem when I went back and taught the rest of the class running around and fixed the problem. At 7.30 at night, he talks to a kid. Every time I've called him, every time I've called for parts, support is phenomenal. Oh, what? Future. <laughs> No, that looks like fun town. <laughs>